Centering a diff or any element can be very scary for a lot of people learning web development. I'm going to show you two very simple ways to do this. It's actually very easy. Here I have some HTML. I have a diff with a class of container and inside of that I have a diff with a class of my block and then some text inside that diff. All right, my goal is to horizontally and vertically center the my block diff. All right, so let's go to the style CSS. I have already some CSS here. I'm gonna go to my block. I'm gonna do the first one. First, make sure position of that diff is relative. And what you do is left 50% and then top 50%. I'm gonna save this. Maybe you think this is the solution and that's it, we're good. Well, it's not. Let me save. And here you go. It doesn't look centered to me, right? So what's happening here, and this is a lot of people getting confused when they use this, is, is the top 50% and left 50% is from here, all right? You can see this corner right here. So just think like 50% left, 50% top, and then you can see it's kind of move, moving the element to this side. So it's not center. So all we have to do to solve this problem is tell the element to go negative 50% to the top and negative 50% to the left. And when I say negative 50%, it's 50% the size of the element, all right? So the size of the element, not the whole container or anything, it's just the element. So I'll do transform, translate, and here you go, top and bottom, um, left and top. So negative 50%, comma, negative 50%. Let's save that. Now we're talking, this is actually center. So this is solving our problem, but there are more ways to center. This is maybe special use cases. Maybe for some reason you have to do this, but let's do the other, the other option. Let's save this. Now I'm going to go to the container of that div. All right. So I'm going to do display flex. All right. Flex is a, is very, very powerful. So all you have to do now is align items, center let's see what happens with with only align item center safe here we go so uh, yeah it's center but um now we need to center horizontally so let's do that justify content center safe and that's about it you're done now this is just the basics of display flex this is just very very basic um, there's a lot you can do with it. You can have multiple elements in, instead of just one and you can center all of them. Let's do that very quick. I'm gonna just duplicate this. Let's save. And you can see we have multiple elements. Now they're actually center both. And of course, uh, maybe adding some margin here can help a little bit with the styling. So let's do just, just 5%, see how it looks. There you go, a little bit of space, it looks better. But both of the elements are centered, looking good. And that's about it.